Hi, I'm Darren. This is the Cyclist Service. I'm on the content management team, and we're going to check out what some of the other teams are up to today. This group is run by Bob McGrath. They're logistics and planning, and we're going to peek inside and see what they're up to. Um, I understand the concern, and the concern is what level of uh, detail do you, do you go? My name's Peter Smith. I'm with the Toronto office, and I'm team coordinator of the Hazardous Locations product group. I've been employed with CSA for over 30 years and I see that uh, here there are a number of things that can be improved but I do present a devil's advocate approach in some situations and I want to make sure that what's being done uh, is going to really benefit the people on the floor. And in here we have customer acquisition. We're going to sneak in and find out what they're up to. If it's not you, it goes to market sector manager. Hi, I'm Lee Severman. I'm in the Cleveland office and I am the Eastern Region Sales Manager. The Cyclo Service is addressing many different issues, looking at different philosophies, how we can best service our customers. You need to service them. The way that the CSA organization is set up now, we don't have customer service being our number one priority, which is what our customers want. I'm Gus Dahl from CSA Rexdale. I'm a job holder in the Occupational Health and Safety. My commitment is to see how our customer will look at CSA and what kind of service we can provide without much delay. We're trying to map a procedure that can be global so that any information can be reached by any person at CSA. This next team is Steve Manning's team. It's content management. I'm actually on this team. My role is team coordinator as a second to Steve and we deal with um, taking documentation and trying to look at it from a new perspective, trying to look at it as content rather than form reports and actual paper documents, and come up with a web-based solution for storing and dealing with those documents. I'm 100% pulled off of my regular job holder job to do this, so we're going to head in and see what they're up to. You've been at all these locations already, right? Hi, I'm Don Giel from the Toronto, and I'm the Senior Engineer from the Power Supplies and Process Controls Group. And we have a very, very uh, aggressive schedule set. I think the uh, challenging things that uh, we run into are, are the timelines and getting things done. We're here with Pat Del Vecchio's group, Customer Administration. We're going to pop in and see what they're up to. Revenue, therefore, has to lead back into uh, manage customer files. Hi, I'm Genevieve Goujon from the Agreements Department here in Toronto and I'm working on the Customer Administration segment of the cycle of service. I think CSA is at the point now where we don't have a choice. CSA needs to make some drastic changes to stay competitive. There's also been feedback through co-workers to say things need to be changed and so we're just trying to decide here how we should change them so that customers and employees are all satisfied and we can have superior customer service across the board with all kinds of consistency and everyone can say, you know what, I want to go to CSA because they turn around stuff, they know what they're talking about, all the people are competent, you call them and you get instant answers. My name is Denise Wood, I'm the project manager for the Cycle of Service project. You've just had a chance to see the design teams in action. I think you'll agree that the work looks pretty tough. This group of people were pulled out from their day job, so to speak, into a really challenging environment uh, where they've been tasked with coming up with new process designs, looking at the implications of, of our process designs with respect to technology, with respect to our organization. And at the end of the day, what we want to do is we want to improve our customer service. It's going to take some time but it's really important to the organization. I think everyone would agree that you know people here really care and they work really hard. So we can do it. 